I'm very delighted to attend this important event of the launch of CWOM book titled Conflict Early Warning in the Horn Sea War Journey. And our congratulations to all who contributed to this work. I believe this book will contribute positively to address the issue of conflicts and conflict prevention and conflicts early warning in our region and our, conflict, our continent. Ladies and gentlemen, conflicts early warning is very essential and vital for the sake of war prevention and stability of the region and security and prosperity of the people in our region and in our com continent. And it goes without saying that through early warning, we can prevent future bloody wars before they happen, which help to avoid wars and its related atrocities and impacts to the security and development of the region. Ladies and gentlemen, it is necessary to work collectively as states and as EGAD, as AU, as United Nations and as international partners to ensure that wars do not occur again in the region. And for this purpose, it is important to take all preventive measures, measures. This including conflicts early warning to alarm us about any future conflicts. And of course, early warning is one of other measures also needed, which is including enhancing of the culture of peace and raising the community awareness towards the issue of peace. Our ultimate, our final goal is to promote the culture and spirit of peace in our region and our continent. Meanwhile, to compact war and war culture so as to make guns finally silent in our beloved region and continent. I would like here to express my thanks once again to EGAD office in South Sudan and for Seaworn for organizing this important event. And I would, like, and would like to mention very finally that the path to sustainable peace in our region might face in some challenges. But I am very confident that with our joint efforts, it is very possible to achieve lasting and comprehensive peace in the region and the continent. And I hope as sustainable peace for our countries, our region, our continent and the world. Thank you very much.